we've got the platform up and running, but we don't have any actual content side yet. To get that, we need to go and install Avenue Clothing, the Razer Demo Store. So let's find that package that we just uh, downloaded from our site. Install local package like before, browse to the uh, demo store there, open it up, load it, and let's again accept the license, install that. And with that, we should, um, we're installing the content sections of uh, Avenue Clothing. It'll uh, add a catalog section. It'll add a full checkout flow and some emails, some search templates. So basically everything you need to, to, uh, to get up and running here. This uh, bit here tells you to, uh, tells uh, this Razer store to install sample information. So it installs a store, it installs, it installs some sample products. So just keep that around. And with that done in a little bit, we just need to go and assign some permissions. So uh, the user currently logged in will be able to see all the stuff installed by the package. And now we'll assign permissions. So the current user will be able to see all the stuff just installed and we're done. All right, so let's go back to WooCommerce and see what changed. So now we've got Avenue Clothing up and running. We've got a demo uh, store catalog and we've got some demo categories with some products in it, uh, at least on this level here. Right, so we've got some shirts and some tires and stuff here. Also installed in the content section is a, a content uh, site here to operate the front end of the site. So you get the catalog section with all the, with all the catalog browsing uh, capabilities. You get the full checkout flow, some, some search and some email templates. Now let's see what that looks like on the front end here. So let's open up the site. And there you go, Avenue Clothing up and running. You get your full uh, catalog browse uh, sections here. You can uh, add stuff to the cart, full checkout, everything up and running in less than 10 minutes. Enjoy.